In this question, we are given the first three terms of a geometric sequence and they want us to determine the value of k. Well, this is one of those questions where you need to do the following. You can say term 2 divided by term 1 must be the same as term 3 divided by term 2. Why? Because this is a geometric pattern. Let me show you an example. If we have another, another geometric pattern which has numbers like 3, 6, 12, we can see that we're multiplying by 2. So would you agree with me that if I take term 2 divided by term 1, well, that's going to give me 6 over 3, which is 2. Is that not the same as saying term 3 divided by term 2? Well, yes, it is, because that's 12 over 6, and that is 2. So we get the same answer. And so we are mathematically allowed to say that. And so that's the difficult part. That's the part that you need to remember. Now what you do is you just fill things in. So T2 is K plus 1 over 4K minus 2 equals to K minus 3 over k plus 1. What you now do in maths when you arrive at a situation like this is you cross multiply. So the k plus 1 would go up there and the 4k minus 2 would go up there. And so it would end up with k plus 1 and another k plus 1 and then on the right it would be k minus 3 and 4k minus 2. We now multiply everything out. So I'm going to do it in a very fast way. I'm not going to multiply every term out. I'm just going to do it because you guys know how to do this. What we then do is we take everything to the one side so that we can have a zero. I'm going to take everything to the left. You could then solve this by factorizing if you're brave, or you could just use the quadratic formula. Either way, if you do it, you should get k is equal to 5 or k is equal to a third.